So the rest of the hydration is done. They've been there for about 15 minutes or so. And I like to restack them back in order. I can do that by the number and also by the leftover or the bottom gray board that was cut out. That's why I leave that there. It just helps me keep track of everything. It is time to assemble now. And what I need to do first is get the background out of this uh, package here. All right, so in pulling the nails out, I use this as a nail puller where I can just very lightly grip and not cut through, but very lightly grip and then lever out the nails. Now from here, I can open this up and I know the background is down at the bottom and there it is. That's the part that I need. I have that part, let me do the other part now. And now it is time to start assembly. I have the background in two pieces. You notice that there is a, uh, the center piece and uh, the larger perimeter and that will need to be bridged with either a stem or some kind of element that joins them together. And that I can do with taking a small, maybe one of the stem pieces here. And the stem piece, I do know that that goes, I think right here. Again, the gum tape is all facing one direction. That's right here. And I'm going to take some tape and try to bind these two together. It will lock together. There we go. And this is just going to temporarily fasten them together until I get a couple more bridges put in.